hello friends welcome back to my channel in this video i will be talking about how you can use 1688.com how you can search with word on 1688.com actually 1688.com is chinese based website is purely chinese website how you can log into your 1688.com how you can buy yourself from 1688.com how you can buy with agents from 1688.com those are the things we want to treat on this topic but for today i want to let you know how you can search with word on 1688.com and that is what i am here for today thank you for stopping by my name is aisha tadiwani i am from carlton corridor and digital intellectual hub now we will have to go into our phone we'll go to our phone screen and we'll be able to record whatever we want to learn today once you download your google chrome you launch your google chrome then let's let's launch our google chrome now we have launched our google chrome now so what we can do now is to open a new tab Once you open a new tab, type in 1688.com, 1688.com, as you can see on my screen, then click on go, or click on any button that you know that can search for you, click on search. Once you click on search, if it is a new Google Chrome, Google Chrome application, it will ask you if it should um translate the page for you as you can see up on my screen before so it will ask you once it asks you accept it but in case of some places or some time maybe your your google chrome doesn't uh doesn't translate uh, into english for you there is a way you can go about it but make sure your google chrome is up to date not that you'll be using google chrome that is not updated there is three dots at the top right corner of your screen if you are using android but if you are using uh, iphone it should be at the top uh, at the down right corner of your screen so for me it, it is at the down right corner of my screen then i'll click on it then i'll scroll down make sure you scroll down then you can see translate so it will translate it for you like that in case it is not translating that's it then let's continue let's take this as an example let's say i want to buy children's wear children clothes this is what i can do i will open a new tab open a new tab click on this plus button or you anyway you can open a new tab on your phone i don't know so you search click on search or type url then you search for google translate google translate click on the google translate once you search for it it will display it just like this then this Chinese simplified you are seeing sometimes it will not display Chinese simplified it will because you are using it for the first time it will display English and it will display the text language just like this what you can do is you can click on this Chinese simp simplified let me show you how it will look this is how it will look if you just if you are just using it for the first time so you can change it to Chinese simplified now Click on Chinese Simplified, search for Chinese Simplified. Then click on Detect Language for the one you want to use. Or you, you can easily click on English also. So now I want to search for Children's Wear. And I'll type in Children's Wear. Children's Wear. children's wear or i should type in children's clothes 
I think that's more straightforward. Once I type in children's clothes, I can type in, I can click on done. Once you click on done, it would have translated it to the to Chinese uh, language for you. Then you can click on these two boxes here. As I've clicked on it now, then it will copy. Then you can go back to the tab you open for your sixteenetate.com. Once you go back, you can come to this search bar as you are seeing on your screen right now. Click on the search bar. Once you click on the search bar, then here on the search bar, click on it again. Then that thing you've copied, paste it. Excuse me. That thing you've copied before, make sure you paste. Oh, it's giving me a wrong this thing. I don't need a link. Okay, let's do it again. If it's happening like it's good that it's happening like this. If it's happening like this, then you go back. Go back to your to that tab you open. Click on it and copy again. Once you copy, now you've pasted again. Then you can click on done. Then you can search. Search. Now you can see there are different children's wear here. There are different children's wear here. So here, as you can see that our 1688.com has not been translated. Anyway, let's continue. So on our, on our screen now, as you can see, we have up to 2,000 different products that has been displayed for us now this first person that we are seeing up here this person has been on 1688 since six years and this person has sold this clothes for up to 3677 people and also this person has 33.1 percent return rate this is where the return rate is it's a good thing that my screen is not translating so that we get used to all these things but for you if you are using android phone it will translate you won't need to come across all this problem all the time so you scroll down let me scroll down to show you another person now this person is a powerful supplier as you can see this red something here and also this person has sold this shirt for up to 47,970 people or 47,970 pieces of this clothes has been sold as you can see here you see that this person has 29.7 percent rate i'm telling us all this because these are the things we have to watch out to to know which seller is the best or which sell which which seller we should not buy from so let's scroll down again as you can see this seller has been has been here since one year and also this seller has 17.2 percent return rate and also this seller has sold 30 pieces of this this clothes and i will not recommend such seller for us because any seller that's that just started uh, selling up to one year um sometimes they may they may not have enough experience so they have to be more than at least three years they should be more than th from three years upward the minimum should be three years or sometimes i may i may see some other sellers that have enough that have sold enough of the clothes so i sometimes buy from them or enough of this of such products i sometimes buy from them if i see that um they they've sold enough and their return rate is good it doesn't matter what year they are or how many years they've been they've, they've, they've been selling on the website i just buy from them once i see that they've sold enough selling enough means 
people go back again to buy from them and once you go once you buy a product and you have that gut in you to go back again to buy such product that means the product is a very good one thank you for having me and that's all we have to know about um, 1688